likes kids fun. Most interesting facts about llamas! Today, we're going to talk about miniature llamas that we met at Millstream Miniature Llamas. Meet Fedra. She loves being brushed. She is pretty old for a miniature llama, which only lived 15 to 20 years, on average. She is 24 years old. Vote us! When will they brush us? She always gets brushed. We want to get brushed too. I guess not today. Again. Ah! Come on, Annie. Let's give them kisses and get their attention while we have their chance. All right, we've kissed them and got their attention. Now let's go munch on some grass. <laughs> Did you get a kiss? Yeah. I got a kiss. You got a kiss from Alana? Now that they really got our attention, we really want to start learning about these very, very cool llamas. Let's start out by learning about these very interesting facts. Did you know to be a miniature llama, not any llama, llamas need to be 38 inches or less on the wither. That's the part where the body and the neck connect. They were originated in North America, but they migrated to South America where they became domesticated. Llamas come in a variety, also known as rainbow, of natural colors and patterns. Their wool is very, very soft and warm. Llamas can be sheared annually in late spring or early summer. With their wool, you can then make scarves, mittens, hats, and socks to keep you warm in the winter. And then you can play comfortably in the snow. very weird fact. Did you know that llamas have one stomach with three compartments? That means they need to chew up their food once, then instead of digesting, it goes into one of their stomachs, comes back up, they chew it again, and goes down again, then comes back and goes down again and comes out as poop. So, it would really take a long time for a llama to eat just one mouthful. I learned this very weird fact. Did you know llamas don't have top teeth? That is crazy for me. That is why llamas can't bite you, because they have no top teeth. Six bottom teeth, molars at the back. So that's what she's chewing with, is her molars. Mm -hmm. And um, then nothing at the top. Now watch her, watch her neck again. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Now she's gonna chew again. Think you could do that? <laughs> no. Now let's take a look at the baby llamas. This is Finnegan. He is only one week old and he's giving us kisses. If you're wondering what a baby llama is called, it is called a creus. It's a Spanish word for baby. Ah! 
This guy here is named Gray. He is one month old. Llamas are very, very social animals. That's why they live as a herd. Now let's check their speed out. They are super duper fast. I mean, like seriously fast. Look at these babies. They're super fast. But the one week old is way faster. You should really see him run. Let's see. Is he gonna come? There he is. See? Look. He is super fast. They cannot only run on grass, but they can also run on rocks because of their two toenails. They have two separate toes with long nails that help them run on rocky surfaces. There they go, very fast. Llamas are very strong and can carry heavy loads through harsh environments. They're also very protective of each other. Ah! Come on, Mom, let's play. I really want to play. Please, can you come play with us? No, all right, guys, let's play chase. Come on, let's see if you can catch me. Can you catch me? I don't think so. I'm super duper fast. I think I'm way too fast for you. I'm so tired of running. Please, could we stop wrestling? Because I don't want to play. Let's play! Let's play! More! And another round of tag! Oh no, not again. I said stop! Please! What are you doing, Danny? Come back! Wait for me! Here's another interesting fact. Did you know llamas are cousins with camels, which were also originally from North America? That is very funny for me because how could a camel cross the ocean? It's very weird. They also spit when they want to protect themselves. We, were, we, we didn't get spitted, we just got lots and lots of kisses again. Some on the face, some on the back. Who are these people? Do they want to play with me? Hmm? No. Maybe if I give them kisses they'll play? Hello? Do you want to play? Are you even listening to me? Hmm. I don't think I can get them attention. their attention. Maybe I can do it by running? No? What about Mama? 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 Can you play with me please? Mama? No? No? Um, maybe I can make them want to play with me if I kiss them? Hmm, no, not really. And who should I play with? Hmm, well, Annie doesn't want to play. Oh, wait, wait, what about Gray? Graystone, Graystone, where are you? Hello? Oh, is that you, Graystone? Come on, let's play tag. Oh well, I guess he can't play with me. Who will play with me next? I'm so tired. Hello? Where's everybody? No more kisses now. It's lunch time. Alright, time for the llama's lunch. Let's see what they're having today. Now let's take a look at the llama's diet. Since they're herbivores, 
Their diet is only plants. They eat ferns and grass in the wild, but when they're kept as pets, they eat grass and can eat six pounds of hay a day. Llamas also don't require much water, which means they really, really live well in the mountains. And as you remembered, it takes them a long time to chew up their food. Kids, it's lunch time, time to eat. Hello? Are you here? Are you listening? We're coming, we're coming. Mmm, this is good. Annie, why aren't you eating so much? I think you should have some more. It's so good. I love hay, Annie. What are you waiting? Why don't you eat some more? It's so good. Think about how lucky it is to have this hay. I love it. So yummy. Annie, please eat some more. It's so, so, so good. Come on, Annie. If you don't eat, you won't have any strength to play. I really want to play. So come on, Annie. Please eat this yummy hay so we can play. Please, Annie, please. All right, now let's meet some of the llamas. This is Freckles. She probably got the name from the freckles she has on her. She loves cookies, so she rings bells, kicks balls, and does other things to earn her cookies, to earn cookies. She is a very smart llama. Now that you've seen Freckles ring a bell, let's see how she plays soccer, or rather kicks the ball. I like soccer too. And like I said, when she kicks the ball, she gets some treats. Here comes Don Dominique. She really wants cookies. She's supposed to let us pet her after, but unfortunately, she only wants the cookies. She doesn't want to be petted right now. While my sister feeds Dominique, Lexi, the black llama, is gonna come, and I'm gonna start feeding her. Oh, there she is, and she doesn't really do let us do anything after we feed her cookies. She she just has them as a treat. Look, they all want cookies. We need to feed them cookies. Hey, wait, didn't these guys already have their cookies? Okay, we'll give you a bit more, but after that, no more cookies, okay? No, 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 we said no more cookies. Okay, next in line. Hey, stop trying to eat cookies. It's next in line. What are you waiting for? I mean, what are you thinking? Come on, these cookies are so good. I want a million more bags of these cookies. It's, hey, it's my turn. No, I was next to mine. Okay. 
No more cookies, but we can pet you if you'd like. Or you could give us kisses if you want. But no more cookies. What about me? I want cookies too. Why don't I get any cookies? Oh yeah, right. I'm supposed to drink Mama's milk. Because I'm a baby. All right, for, for a fresh reminder, <laughs> let's remember their snacks they, and their main diet. They usually eat hay and grass, but <laughs> they could also have special llama cookies that are not for humans. They also have yeah. healthy treats. Mm. This is Poco Roco, or Poco for short. He is the llama that loves carrots the most. He likes carrots so much, he'd do lots of things for just one carrot. Oops. More? You already ate a whole bucket of carrots! And one more. One. Now the video is almost over, but first we want to have a we want to give a loud, nice, loud thank you to Millstream Miniature Llamas who gave us this exciting tour so that we could learn about llamas, feed them, get kisses from them, pet them, and much, much more. If you ever want to visit these cuties, you could go to Millstream Miniature Llamas. There also might be some new baby. Mommy, I'm ready to go home. Can we please, please take Poco home? No, 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 no. Of course we can't. He belongs here. This is his home. We can't take him home at all. Bye, llamas, and thank you to everyone who watched. Please like and subscribe the video. Bye. The end.